Disney Plus just released their poster for the most overrated character in Star Wars history, Boba Fett. Let's talk about it. Before I jump into the video, I have to inform you that Mary Poppins Leia just telepathically communicated with me using the Force. She says you need to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you get these videos right into your feed. What's that? Oh, she's gone. Uh, Princess Leia just flew back into space to, to fight aliens and punch asteroids and stuff. What we're looking at here is a very fine poster. It's not setting the world ablaze by any means. It's not insulting. It's just a... It's getting the job done. We have our lead hero, the titular character, Boba Fett. He's sitting on a throne of sorts. I don't know much about Star Wars lore uh, outside of surface level stuff. Probably a little bit more than your average bear, but not enough to really dive into this poster in any meaningful way. So I will now. If you take a look at this poster, you'll notice there's not much light going on outside of the one source coming from a top off in the distance. It gives not only a sense of scale to the room or depth to the room, but also the fact that this room's not very well lit for a reason. It's been lost to civilization. He has rediscovered it. Uh, it tells the audience what they can expect from a show like this. There's going to be some spelunking. Fett's going to be traveling to new locations, unearthing secrets, and discovering not only hidden gems, but also discovering himself in the process. He's on a throne, he's a king, he's reclaiming as his bounty, he's reclaiming his glory. After falling into a sarlacc pit like a bitch, can we talk about this character? The guy gets bested accidentally by a clueless Han Solo who hits the side of his backpack, jetpack, he flies into the side of his ship and then falls into the pit below. How embarrassing. It feels like it's been an eternity since we've seen a painted poster, and I can't tell, honestly, if this is fully painted or if it's just drawn on top of a photo. It looks like it is. It looks like it's, it's painted or, or drawn somehow. If we zoom in and enhance, we can see that upon blowing up, he's got his blaster pointed between his legs. He's showing his dominance, showing his alpha male status. He means business. He, he's testing you. He's tempting you to come take what's his. He dares you. Unless you're eating a banana and you throw the peel behind you because he's certainly going to slip on that, comically fly across the room and go out a window to his death. How did he live again? How is he still alive? Wasn't it some bullshit about killing the Sarlacc pit by burning it out with this torch on his hand? Or say, Wait, what? It doesn't matter. Don't defend this. Just like bringing Darth Maul back after he was cut in half. Just like bringing Emperor Pelpy back when he was thrown down into the dead of space after being electrocuted. Nothing matters, it's space magic, right? I like the poster, the only thing that's not really fitting is the logo. It's fine, it's a little poppy for me, it's jumping out a lot. I understand you, you want the audience to go there and then see that obnoxious Disney Plus logo below. I would have liked a little bit more shading on it, it's very flat. You know, give it some depth, put some shadow around those letters, uh, let it let it grow, let it come at you a little bit more. It really feels just kind of stuck on there and not part of the poster. End of the day, a poster is far more than this chump deserves. He got a great song by MC Chris. He's had several comics and, and uh, appearances on things like The Mandalorian Season 2. So yeah, they're, they're really trying to make Boba Fett a thing to appease the nerd fans. I, I just don't get it, I never will. People criticized Captain Phasma when she was announced. Uh, a lot of people were like, oh, I thought she was going to be awesome. I thought she was going to be just like Boba Fett. She was just like Boba Fett. She was. She was a bitch. Just like he was. They got bested super easily. She was Boba Fett. Where's her show? Where's her crappy show? All right, that's all I got. Are you excited for the Boba Fett TV series coming out or are you lukewarm like I am? I love the Mando, I love Mandalorian, so, you know, this this has potential. I just, why, why him? Let me know in the comments, like the video if you had a good time, subscribe if you haven't, and hopefully I'll see you soon. Thanks again for watching the video. If you like the little poster breakdown I did, I have more of them on Star Wars. You can, you can find them on my uh, poster playlist I have, amongst other movie-related content here. You could also join me on Patreon or right here on YouTube via the Join button. And if you don't want to, that's fine. But you know what? You do want to. You will go to patreon.com slash adamdoesmovies and leave me some money. Because you, you, you like me. Right now. Do it. I don't think it's working.